Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone is having a great day. So we're going to go ahead and continue with our collective reads. This will be for all signs, which means it may or may not resonate with you in your personal situation. If it does, take what resonates. If it does not, leave the rest for those that it applies in their personal situation. Collective, yo, somebody's out here trying to mess with you like big time on purpose for their own enjoyment. Like it's coming out to me as like they're playing a prank on you, but it's not a prank. It's not. And I think you know this already. It's got like a lot of malicious intent to it. Y'all, this energy comes out through like multiple readings. So um, this is like way too long for this one particular reading. So I'll continue to upload as the energy comes out. But it's somebody that was mad at you yesterday. Whoever that person was, they were still in their feelings. Put the energy at where it resonates with whomever it is. Friend, family member, the ex, the coworker, the boss, your coworker trying to be your boss, whoever it is. It's somebody that's messing with you on purpose that's carrying moon energy, okay? Somebody's still in their feelings, you know what I'm saying? And, and this is because you cut them off, you blocked them, or however the situation was. This is like why, right? And this moon energy, it's all about deception. They're deceiving you about something. Whatever they're coming across with, it's a lie. It's a straight up lie. They're in their feelings. They're in their emotions. This does talks about the energy, not only deception, but insecurities. Somebody dealing with their own insecurities, you know what I'm saying? Trying to project them onto you. Also, you know, the energy, it's um, moon energy is also feminine energy. So possibly a feminine um, person that's doing this, but it doesn't have to be. It's just somebody moving in moon energy. Whoever this two of cups in reverse is, right? Whoever this disloyal friend is, whoever this particular person is who has ro uh, romantic problems or just as relationship problems in general, you know what I'm saying? Whoever this particular person is, is still in their feelings, but they're carrying Page of Wands energy, trying to have get good news, have childlike enthusiasm to bring you a nine of swords, to make you stressed out, worrying, and having anxiety. That's what they wanted. Y'all, and I got to download about this because the Page of Wands came out on my last reading last night. Most High was telling you to chill right now. You know what I'm saying? That Most High was telling you to do something, right? It's talked about their motives. Here it is right here. But the Most High told me this was going to get blocked. What the good news that they wanted for you is actually going to be good news uh, or you want to get news for them, it's actually going to turn out to be good news for you. And it's because of the fact that you are a star seed, right? And this is what's coming to me in my downloads, um, you know, being a light worker, however you class yourself, an earth angel, you know what I'm saying? It's because of that. What they wanted is not going to happen, but you've got this eight of pentacles to the seven of pentacles out here again. The fact that you're a hard worker, something about your work that somebody was trying to like poke fun at, you know, um, trip you up about something about that, your, your skills, something with this, uh, seven of pentacles energy, it was asking you to have patience about the situation. There was something that you didn't know. Somebody was deceiving you, you know what I'm saying? But it was all for their enjoyment. They wanted to see this, you know what I'm saying? Collective, the seven of pentacles talks about persevering. Patience is key. And I was telling you guys that yesterday, patience is key dealing with this temperance in the inverse energy this discord, somebody doing way too much, but you're coming out as a star in this particular energy because the truth comes out, right? Your star energy, you're, you're shining, you're a guide, right? You're a light at the end of the tunnel. It's like, you're, you're going to find your way out of this, but the, the energy that they carry is very deceptive. And I'm feeling like it's, they're trying to act like it's like a prank. It's not, it's not. You know what I'm saying? The fact that you're coming out as a star, it means you're going to overcome this energy or you already did, you know what I'm saying? With your star energy, but it's like your, your wishes, your God, you, you have, you know, inspiration, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, regardless of whatever they're trying to do, you were going to shine through it anyway, because this Ace of Swords is out here. The truth is out. You see something very clearly. You, you, the truth is out what somebody is doing, what their intentions are, the moon energy, you see what time it is, right? This person is uh, carrying four pentacles in the reverse energy. This is somebody who just can't lose. They're always doing something. And I don't care if they're trying to say it's a joke. It's not. It's very malicious, right? Very, very malicious in what they're doing. It, it, it's not a joke, right? They're mad because it is five of, uh, five of swords in reverse energy. The, the fact that they you walked away from them or they had to walk away from this conflict and this is what was going on, they were mad because they got blocked. Ace of Wands in reverse told you. This is somebody who your ex is mad that you cut them off. Your coworker is mad. Your boss is mad that you cut them off. They are just mad. That's that's the energy that came out yesterday. This is the same energy. So just because they're mad, they're in their feelings and they want to get you back. But it's coming across like a joke, but it's not. They're trying to get their lick back. Legit collector. I'm telling you what I'm getting. Somebody carrying Queen of Swords in reverse energy. 
being a liar, being very manipulative and very vindictive. This was to get their lick back. Legit. You're being called to have the seven of cups in reverse energy. Set your intentions, find your focus. And if, if the energy feels like a cloud that you were having to walk through, you are dealing with some heavy deception here about somebody that wanted to get you back about something. You cutting them off, you leaving them out in the cold. However, this is, if this is your ex, they're still trying to get you back. They're, they're going to come back with some, Hey, baby, baby business, but like trying to do something to trip you up just to stress you out. I told you y'all, that's what people be out here trying to do. They love watching you like this. They love it. But the most high is telling me this is not going to turn out the way that they hope legit seven of cups energy seven of cups in reverse you were being called to make the right decision in this particular energy because somebody wanted to keep some stuff going mm -mm. living in the past and not wanting to transform you know whoever this particular person is this could be your co-worker mad that you're not you're not at work that work today and this is like the most laziest person in the office who don't do no works and they're mad that they actually got to do some work because you're not there all right collective you know what i'm talking about somebody that does not want to transform they want to stay in the past but it's something that they want to keep going this is it's a nasty energy that i'm getting this is a guy, very very nasty person literally nine of cups energy told you this is um the fact that the page of wands is coming out next to the nine of swords they enjoy or wanted to enjoy stressing you out to have a nine of cups their personal satisfaction their wishes granted so they can get their abundance this thief i told y'all I t this is what people be out here trying to do literally a three of pentacles in reverse this is a bad team player could have been that same person or somebody else working with a group of people right <coughs> excuse me a bad team player somebody who does shoddy work you know what i'm saying this is somebody who's heavy in their ego right now heavy heavy ego uh whatever they're doing or whatever they did was in their ego to try to trip you up to try to you know catch you off guard whatever that is to get their wishes granted they wanted some satisfaction with something carrying the world in reverse they're having setbacks and they're having delays but the thing about this is like i think this is like their intention for you because whatever their plan is that's what they wanted they wanted the the nine of cups they wanted to have the the nine of swords they wanted to enjoy watching you stress out you know what i'm saying collective this person is something somebody who doesn't put in the effort to get whatever they want except they'll be malicious about it you know if they can see you just running around in circles that's that's enough for them you know what i'm saying collective this is definitely somebody who wants to have some type of um you know world in the reverse energy projected towards you so you can have delays and setbacks this is what i'm getting but this is really their true energy they're projecting it onto you because this person is a king of pentacles in the reverse right this king of pentacles in the reverse this is somebody who's just very dominant this might be the same person it might be a different person whoever this particular person is this person is trying to maintain control over something i do get a, a masculine energy so this may be a feminine energy this may be a masculine energy working together um so this person is like trying to have control over something about having some type of setbacks you know what i'm saying giving you setbacks wanting the the world without working for it being lazy so they can be like oh we tripped up the collective oh we made the collective look bad and then just sit back and enjoy the ride that's what this energy is you know what i'm saying collective literally for the nine of wands in reverse to make you weak so you can give up this person and or people wanted you to give up to make you weak to make you drop your defenses that's exactly what this person and or people wanted to do to you you know what i'm saying collective and they wanted to keep going with the three of wands but I'm getting this energy that the Most High was telling you to keep going with it because this was, I'm getting like heavy, heavy deception, trickery, like devil energy. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, high priestess and the inverse energy. They were doing this on purpose and they were watching. They wanted to see how you reacted. That legit, this is the energy that I'm getting. You know what I'm saying, collective? The energy is coming out next as the uh, Knight of Wands in the reverse. You know what I'm saying? This is an energy of rushing, being impatient. You know what I'm saying? The fact that, <coughs> excuse me, the fact that they wanted to make you rush and being impatient, but this is their energy. Once again, a negative energy projection, but somebody like heavy in their ego, they wanted to keep going with this because this is their energy, but I'm really feeling like they're pushing it onto you. So if you were feeling rattled, that's why that nine of swords with the projection towards you. If you were feeling weak, like you don't know what to do, that's why that was an energetic projection. If you were feeling like you were rushing and you were being impatient with the situation, that's why it was an energetic projection, but it was their energy very much moving in their ego they wanted to keep going with it literally four swords in reverse they was doing way too much with this particular energy but the sad sad thing most told me you're the person in power in the situation 
And the energy is coming out after that, and I'll upload that in my next reading. Your power is about to take the front center stage. It, your power is what you were called to do. You were being called to lead in this particular situation, not follow along behind somebody who's just going to play with you, play in your mind, play, play in your face. Nah, the most high was telling you to stand up and do something because you have authority in this particular situation, not them. Whoever this is, and like I'm, I feel like they're like trying to laugh it off like it's no big deal. It absolutely is because they wanted to enjoy it. Devil energy, anybody? They wanted to enjoy this. Y'all, this is what they be doing out here. Uh -uh. Your emperor energy is way too powerful for this. Take charge is what I'm hearing. Uh, the most high say the fact that you are what I'm getting, you know, star seed, earth angel, or however you classify yourself. You have protection in this particular situation. You have something to do is what the most high told me. <laughs> you got work to do. Legit. Y'all can't tell me you got work to do with that eight of pentacles to the seven of pentacles energy. I heard the most high said you got work to do. These people are not going to stop you. Okay, so the, the fact that the emperor energy is here tells you stand in your power. Don't let anybody try to take that away from you because they were trying to make you weak. All right, collective, I will upload another reading after this. But after um, as of right now, let's get a vision of duality and get some advice for our collective. Card 12 talks about a betrayal. Yep, this was a straight betrayal. Um, however, this resonates, whether this is that ex trying to come back, trying to play with you, they didn't want nothing. They just wanted to see you at, at a, like a low point so they can like point and laugh. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm getting like, they wanted to laugh it off. Like it's no big deal. All they want to do is to see you react. That's it. That's really all they want to do is to see you react. That's really all it is. So when it comes to, you know, that particular energy, just make sure that you're handling it in the best possible way. Okay. Collective, we can be betrayed and we can betray. If we do or act as someone that we are not, we are betraying ourselves. After that, it takes the longest time before we can forgive ourselves and start rebuilding what we have destroyed. This betrayal executes our soul and it's not worth it, no matter how precious the traitor's reward is offered. If one cannot say no, it can at least not say yes, as woe comes to those who betray themselves without realizing it. Yep, that's why you were being called to make the right decision here, because you were being betrayed. You know, are you going to, you know, sit around and be okay with that? Most I said no. Advice. Be true to yourself and others will have a chance to be true to you. Um, and there's a quote here. It says, it is easier to forgive an enemy than to forgive a friend. Mm -mm. Whoever this two of cups in reverse, this uh, disloyal friend, is name, it's not a friend. This is somebody who is in their feelings because you cut them off. They got blocked and they tried to get you back for it. But not a friend at all. Trying to betray you. Mm -mm. Most high said no. Stand in your power. Let's get a divine nature oracle and we'll wrap it up. Literally. Card 34. Own your power legit and that's what's coming to me in the energy of the cards that's what's coming to me in my downloads human beings are hardwired for love and belonging we are also hardwired for struggle when facing challenges it's necessary to hold both of these truths in your hands the power to withstand crisis and change comes from the instructableness of our soul stuff likewise our heart's resiliency comes from a sense that we belong to the divine to each other and to our own lives if you were not raised with this truth let this moment catalyze the inherent truth of you you are bigger than you know, stronger than you think, and more radiantly loved than any happy fairy tale. Use that truth to transform everything that you touch. Yep, legit. You're you're the emperor here. You're the one that's in control of the situation and heavy on discipline and what you do and how you move in this particular situation. This is what's going to carry you through. As I said, I'm going to go ahead and pull more, more energy after, uh, after this. But as of right now, that's going to go ahead and wrap up this reading. If you do like this content, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until the next time, bye-bye.